Lindsay Koya. I'm the creator and founder of Silky Sacks, and I'm here today to do a review on this Outray Pretty Quick Ponytail 24 inches, y'all. But before we get into that, there's a few things I have to do. If this is your first time coming to Silky Sacks, I want to say welcome. Thank you so much. Here, we come to you every single Monday with wig reviews, product reviews, hair tips, hair tutorials, and it is free. So go ahead and smash that subscribe button. And if you're watching over on Facebook, we love you on the FB too. Go ahead and give this video a like and a share. And then on both platforms, comment down below and let me know what you're thinking of the ponytail. Here at Silky Sex, we know just how important it is to really take care of your wigs and hair extensions so that you get the most out of them. So we have put together a free PDF called five things that you're doing that is destroying your wig. They are things that you could be doing every single day. We've gotten a lot of feedback from people who've downloaded who said they actually were doing some of the things and they were very grateful that we created the PDF. So take the time to go ahead and download it. It will be down in the description box. It is free and find out if you're doing these things, sis and bruh. And if you are, you gotta stop, right? We wanna make these hair pieces and wigs last for as long as possible. And here at Silky Sex, I love to send a shout out to my subs. I call them my silky chicks. But today I'm sending a shout out to my silky bro or silky bruh. I don't know, you tell me. It's Jamal Nolan. He is a fellow YouTuber. Jamal is excellent, you guys. He has a series called Culture Breakdown where he breaks down the top people and things that are in the black culture. He does excellent work. You will truly enjoy his channel. He also has a podcast, but he shows the video of the podcast and they're quite entertaining. Sometimes he does story times. So the link to Jamal's channel will be down in the description box. Please go over there and check it out. You will not regret it and let him know that Silky Sacks sent you. Now, without further ado, let's talk about this ponytail. So this is Altre's Pretty Quick Pony. It says that it's styles in a snap. It's made of premium synthetic fiber. It's great for high and low ponytails. It's definitely bulk free. It's quick and easy. It's definitely lightweight and it is soft to the feel and it does have like a little bit of a shine to it because it is synthetic. Um, I got it in the 1B and it does come in some other colors. Now, I really love ponytails, especially for this time of year when it's hot. You don't want to always wear a heavy wig or something that's lighter on your hair. So I like that this is lighter. However, if you have thicker hair, you know, doing it up in a high ponytail is really kind of tough. You'll see as you continue to watch the issue that I had with it. I probably will rock it again, but I'll have to do it in um, a lower ponytail like here on the stock card. Unfortunately for me, I did run into some issues trying to do it in this higher up, like more of a genie style ponytail, but I do like the texture. I feel like the texture really goes along good with my natural hair, um, the wave pattern. This is the natural wave and I believe they have different textures. Um, this is also heat friendly, but I don't know why you would want to put heat in it. Um, if you needed to put heat in it, you can, but if you want it straight, I would just get a straight ponytail because I believe they have a straight texture, but that's all I have. Without further ado, let's go ahead and watch how I styled it and you can just see how um, it kind of didn't work out for me, but I did my best to make it work anyway. All right, go ahead. So I've already brushed my hair into a bun. I use my leave-in conditioner and water in order to do that. And then I took the uh, I took the ponytail and turned it into a bun. And then I tied it down with my Silky Sacks Edge Scarf so that it would be laid in order to save time for the video. If you'd like to see from beginning to end how I put my ponytails on and how I put my hair into a bun to put the ponytail on, I will link those videos down in the description box. You can also watch my ponytail playlist. So now let's open up the ponytail. So here she is. This is the Outre Pretty Quick Pony. Okay, so here she is out of the packaging and the curl pattern is nice. As I'm rubbing my fingers through, I'm not getting any shedding or tangling. This is the part that you would wrap around your uh, ponytail to disguise it. And then there is two combs here and one comb in the middle. Now I'm a little concerned because this isn't very thick. I don't know if it's gonna cover my bun all the way up, but let's go ahead and put her on. You guys know in the past I've had issues with these ponytails, so let's see if this one will be different. Where's the comb? All right. So 
right off of the bat, it is not covering up my bun all the way, but we're going to try anyway. Can't really see what I'm doing right now, so I'm just going to wrap it just so you guys can kind of get an idea and then I'll take everything off. So this is the ponytail. This is it high up. Let me bend down because my camera. So it's okay. Let me take my scarf off. So now this ponytail does seem like it's quick and um, easy, but you really have to have a small bun or a tiny bun. I probably shouldn't have did a bun. I probably should have did a ponytail and it would have probably laid a lot flatter. God, I couldn't get my scarf off today. So, so I'll show you the right, the left, and the back. So you guys already know, a sister cannot see. So I'm going to go in the bathroom, properly put the ponytail on, and then we will come back and discuss my final thoughts. Okay, you guys, so I'm back. So I'm sorry, I just cannot see on my little viewfinder to really put these ponytails on right. So I went ahead and pushed the combs in, grab the part, and then took my head and tilted it to the side, and then I just took and wrapped the ponytail around. Now I can tell you my bun is not all the way covered up like I said earlier. It's not all the way covered up, and what I noticed was when I would hold my head a certain way when I was putting it on, it literally would fall and you could see the bun. So I wrapped the part that you wrap around it. I wrapped it all the way around and then I put some bobby pins in to secure the bottom. And then I went ahead and put some bobby pins at the top as well and secured some hair to make sure that it's over the bun so that it wouldn't, you know, if I'm moving my head around and my ponytail is moving around, that it wouldn't fall so that the bun is exposed. So I went ahead and did that and then after that I went in with my Eco Style Gel and just touched up the ponytail area right here and then touched up my baby hairs. Now, in theory, ponytails are awesome especially for this time of year because it's super hot, this is lightweight and it's easy, but if you have thicker or longer hair, this is just not enough hair to really wrap around. Now, if I took my bun down and put it in a ponytail, it might be a little bit better, but I still don't think that this is enough hair to really cover that up. So I would not recommend this ponytail for anyone who has thick hair or anyone who has longer hair. I think this is perfect for someone who has maybe shorter hair and um, whose hair isn't as thick because this you don't get a lot of room and it's what I thought it was going to do but you know these ponytails aren't that expensive so it's not a total loss I mean I can make it work on a video but I don't think I would wear it outside I would totally get clocked because if the wind blows hard or if I move my head a certain way if it's not you know pinned all the way you would definitely see that bun and no so it is going to be a no for me but just because it's a no for me doesn't mean it won't work for you I do like that it's not super thick it's just not going to work for my hair and of course when I take the ponytail off I'm not going to put it back into the plastic bag that it came out of I'm going to put it in my luxurious silky sack a silky sack is a silk lined bag that I invented to not only store your wigs and hair extensions but also to protect them the silk lining allows the hair to just glide, cutting down on the shedding, tangling, and matting that it would do if you put it back in the plastic. So if you're interested in Silky Socks and some of the other products that we sell, go ahead and check out the link to the website. It will be down in the description box. Thank you so much for watching. As always, better care is better wear, and I hope to see you again next Monday. <music>